Hello, Brian Sibley from McKay Marine. Uh, another short video on Olex. I've had a few requests from customers. Uh, I know this has been a frustrating thing sometimes. Um, something gets set on their keyboard or if someone hits a key and before they know it, they've dropped a few thousand event marks. Um, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you how to remove those very quickly. Uh, if you individually delete them, it's gonna take forever. So if we look here, our vessel sailing along, what I do is I uh, come up here to these little circles here, and I basically make an outline box. I'm gonna make the box a bit bigger to enclose these two other color marks just to show how to be selective and what we delete, okay? So I bring that down, I can bring another one down if I want to, really doesn't matter. The key here is I go over and I called an area. So once I called an area, we get some other selections here. And what I want is objects. And it's gonna tell me there's 348 plotter objects inside that box, okay? So what I can do, I can delete them all, which if I only had the green X's here, that's what I would do, I would click delete. But since I have the red X and the yellow X that I wanna keep, I don't wanna do that. So what I would do is I'd go down to this button that says line or symbol. Then it says it applies only to the green X's. I can see I have 346. If I was to change that to the red X, I'll see I only have one. And the items will flash. So that's a key thing to let you know um, how, many, how many items are being selected. And then you can choose to delete, export it, move it to a different plot layer, however. So I wanna go back to my green X's. And I'm going to say, uh, the, it only applies to those green X's and you see them flashing. So I just go here and I hit delete these objects. Do you really want to delete? Yes. And bang, they're gone. But yet my green, my red X and my yellow X are still there. And just to show you how that looks, if I put the cursor here, um, or on the boat and I just hit the event mark, you'll see how it will drop a continuous. And this can be pretty much any key except for the function keys. So be very careful. I've heard people set coffee mugs on them. You know, they get pinched because someone set a book on top. Um, again, it's very difficult to remove those if you do it individually, the click, edit, delete mark. However, um, if you use the box, it's very quick to get rid of them. Put the box around, come down, call it an area. Then I go to objects and 161, just that quickly. And I say delete these objects, and they're gone. Simple as that. Another uh, short note from Olex.